This tutorial teaches you how to create an old film look in Adobe After Effects. Create a new project and import your video. Drag your video onto the new composition icon. Go to Layer, New, Adjacent Layer. Go to Effect, Color Correction, Tint. Change the white color to E, 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 C, C, C. Go to Effect, Color Correction, Curves. Create an S-curve, in order to add some contrast. Go to Effect, Noise and Grain, Add Grain. Set the Viewing Mode, to Final Output. Go to Layer, New, Solid, and create a black layer. Go to Effect, Noise and Grain, Fractal Noise. Set the Contrast to 250, and the Brightness to minus 100. Click on Transform and uncheck the Uniform Scaling. Set the Scale Width to 1, and the Scale Height to 10,000. Set the Opacity to 50%. Go to Evolution, and Alt-click on the Stopwatch. Type in time, asterisk, 200, and then just click away from the box. Right click on the top layer, go to blending mode, and click on add. Select the top layer and duplicate it by hitting Ctrl D or Command-D if you are on a Mac. Set the contrast to 350, and the brightness to minus 150. Click on Transform and check the Uniform Scaling. Go to Layer, New, Solid, and create a black layer. Go to Rectangle Tool, hold your left mouse button, and select the Ellipse Tool. Double click on the Ellipse, and then go to the Mask, and select the Subtract option. Select the top layer, press F on your keyboard, and set the mask feather to 250. Press T on your keyboard, and set the opacity to 75%. Select your video and duplicate it by hitting Ctrl D, or Command D if you are on a Mac. Double click on the ellipse, and then go to the mask, and select the Subtract option. Press F on your keyboard, and set the mask feather to 250. Go to Effect, Blur and Sharpen, Fast Blur.
set the blurriness to 5. Click on RAM Preview, to see the result.